Hello guys, welcome back to the GSM Vlogs. Today, as you can see, I'm in a different location than my house. I am at the Bingo Park, which has got recently renovated. That behind me is the YMCA, also known as the Peach Friends Leisure Centre. And yeah, I'm going to show you all the things about these two main places that people want to buy houses near it. And let's get going. So guys, the Peter Corinz Leisure Centre, or before it was called YMTA. You can, uh, this is like a swimming pool. So there's spas, baby swimming pool, medium swimming pool, and then there's the obviously adult sized ones. Now over here you can take swim lessons, learn swimming, do your own swimming after you've done it, take a spa. Um, if you walk through this corridor right here, you end up near the gym and it's good for like um, exercising. Over there we have the bowling club and now, well right now it's closed because of the COVID restrictions. So yeah, if you want to exercise, it's right there, right next to the houses. Now I will... Um, introduce you to the Bendigo Playground or not Bendigo Playground, Eagle Hook Playground. So guys behind me is the playground. I'll just give you a little round tour up. There's lots of people um, over here so sorry if I can't capture most of the park but it is a highly must visit place for many many people so now I'm going to show you a few uh, videos of my sister playing here me playing here and the pool stick I also forgot to mention this is a place for all ages adults, younger and kids Um, right there, as you can see, my sister's jumping on it. That is a musical tyre. So when you jump on it, they've actually put an accordion in there. So when you jump on it, it presses it and gives you different sounds. This whole area behind me is for the toddlers and kids aged below 10 years old and uh, they can have fun over here but now we will get to the big kids playground and yes that tower is magnificent guys by the way this playground is near a lake this lake is called Lake Canterbury because it's near the Canterbury uh, park which is over that way skate park that way and playground over this way so yeah you can fish over here as well This lake and playground is open to all birds and all type of other birds that swim in the lake. I'll give you some video. Um, the big massive tower and this, my friend, is a... I, I like to call it the tornado. So literally it spins you around until you're very, very... Have a look at the view of night time at this lake. It is just beautiful. And also, this part, so this goes all around the lake, meaning you can have a little track all around this lake. So, yeah, 
Tomorrow I'll also show you there's an island over there which you can go to. You can't see it properly in this video. So tomorrow morning I'm going to record again and show you that island, the BMX park clearly and the relaxation garden. Two thousand years later. So it's um, six o'clock and um, not exactly the morning like I told you guys. So we are right now having a speedy walk race. Me versus mum and let's see who wins. Right now, she is winning. Guys, I'm a little puffed out from um speed walking but uh, we have reached the island the middle of this lake so I'll uh, show you and uh, yeah let's continue the trail you'd come up from a trail from there to here and then you'd see a little resting spot normally people fish here uh, beautiful skies we have our two ladies to go forward and um that's a little shortcut way if you want to go that way another resting spot over here there's the rest of the lake over that way um but better go here Road. Some small little feeding place. Small little feeding station for our little. Oh my god. Yeah, so this is why I don't promote fishing because people most of the time fish for sport, not hunger or eating. As you could uh, see. There's a little bit of um, solution over here, which I don't recommend either. So now we're going to the central area. One way to cross, one way to come. Come on. We have crossed the rocky central bridge. We are actually almost at the middle. I'm gone. Yeah, the park over there, as you can see. And, uh, yeah. Now, over there, uh, maybe if you can't see or not, there's a skate park and the pool over that side. Uh, during our round, we're going to go from there to the pool. I mean the, uh, the skateboard area and then uh, the pool and then head back to the park. So it's like a big continuous loop. Okay, so let's We're head at back. the skate park. Okay. That way is the Canterbury Park. That, if you guys want to see that, uh, please comment below and tell me if you want to see that park as well it's a part of this park as well yeah it's part of uh, this lake as well but this pathway leads to canterbury park tell me if you want to see that area as well meanwhile this is a swimming pool um right now it's closed because of the um coronavirus the covid19 uh if it opens yes i would be sure to show you some other things about this pool and why it's so great I also did swimming here and I've completed my full swimming education here. We also have a gym that way, a little tennis court this way to the cafeteria. So I'll show you these later if I can. But please do comment down below if you want to see the Canterbury Park. Really beautiful. So guys, this was the Canterbury Park. This is free for all. And um, over here there's some barbecues as well, which you can um, uh, barbecue on for free view of the lake pretty cool lake and yeah i highly recommend this area 
It's getting dark, so we're gonna go home. See you in the next vlog. Bye!